Hello everyone, I'm Xin Yizhang from the Chinese University of Hong Kong. I'm very glad to introduce our paper, What's Deeper Understanding of PPR-Based Embedding Approaches? Given a graph G with n nodes and m edges, node embedding aims to map nodes in the original graph into d-dimensional representations. Node embedding has received significant attention in the last few decades. Among these studies, random walk approaches and matrix factorization approaches are representative solutions. Recently, several matrix factorization approaches first compute a PPR-related proximity matrix and then factorize this matrix to generate low-dimensional representations. PPR-based embedding approaches have achieved state-of-the-art performances on various graph mining tasks. Figure 2 shows classification results on two datasets. As we can observe, PPR-based embedding approach outperform random walk-based approach by a significant margin. Similar results on other graphs can be found in recent studies. However, limited research study has investigated the encoded information within these PPR-based node embeddings or explore how this information facilitates downstream graph mining tasks. To fill this research gap, we focus on three fundamental research questions. Firstly, what topological information can be encoded by PPR-based approaches? Secondly, what is the relationship between spectral approaches and PPR-based embedding approaches? Thirdly, why do PPR-based embedding approaches consistently outperform random walk-based alternatives? We briefly summarize our contributions as follows. We present a closed-form framework that unifies several state-of-the-art PPR-based embedding approaches. We present PPIEI, a framework that consists of two PPR-based embedding inversion methods for the graph recovery task. Thirdly, extensive experiments on six real-world graphs demonstrate that PPIEI can preserve more accurate topological information, having a new topological perspective to explain why PPR-based node embedding approaches outperform random walk-based alternatives.